Hi everyone, it's Talia and welcome back to my channel and welcome back to another video. So for today's video, I'm going to be doing a Princess Polly haul. Princess Polly kindly reached out to me and asked if I wanted to work on this video with them and when I saw their stuff, I was like, oh my goodness, hell to the yeah. If you guys haven't heard of Princess Polly, then you need to get out from underneath the rock you've been living under because their stuff is incredible quality. It's all so, so cute and you guys will see from my haul, I'm literally obsessed with everything that I got, so yeah, if you guys haven't checked them out, go check them out. I do have a discount code, it's just lovetalia 20 I will leave it on screen and that will obviously get you guys a little bit of savings because... Who doesn't love saving some money? Also guys, I'm currently hosting a giveaway with Princess Polly, so head over to my Instagram to go check out the rules. So this haul will obviously be a try and haul and I will leave a link to Princess Polly and basically everything that I'm gonna show you guys down in the description. So if you wanna get your little hands on any of these pieces, then you can get it pretty easily. So the first item that I want to talk about is actually this stunning top that I have got on right now. So this is what the top looks like and you guys, honestly, how like how stunning is this top so again this is just another close-up of the top i really like it because the sleeves are elastic as well i love all the detailing this isn't actually proper boning it's just you know sewed fabric but underneath the cups it is wired and you can tighten this to however tight you want it if you have a little bit of a bigger chest and obviously you can make more room but honestly i'm so obsessed with this top also what i really like is you won't be able to see but inside the sleeve here it actually has i don't know what it really is let me try and show you guys this little shiny bit here it's a little bit sticky not like sticky to touch but it kind of like grips onto your skin so you won't have you know a shoulder pulling down situation which i think is really good because there's nothing more annoying than having to like keep on pulling up your sleeve so at least with that stuff i don't know what it is someone in fashion probably knows a lot better than i do but it kind of just stops the sleeve from pulling down which i think is really useful i got this actually in a size six normally i'm a size eight in tops what i will say i will go through the sizes of everything so if you guys are similar to me then you can kind of you know work out your sizing but with the tops i'm so happy i've got this in a size six and maybe with the tops i would always size down but anyway staying on with the um white top theme this top is very similar to the one that i've got on right now but it's, i think it's a little bit more casual so this is what it looks like obviously you guys will see a lot better on the try on clip it's basically just like a more chilled out version of what i've got on i would say that what i've got on now is definitely the dressier version of this but then at the same time i can go out and i can have two options of the tops that i want to wear so again this is just elasticated all over obviously it doesn't have any of the cup detailing and it's literally just a top that you just you know slide on no zips no buttons no nothing but this is super super comfortable and i also like it because it has elastic going through it so i did also get this in a size 10 so in the trial clip you guys will see how it fits they didn't have an eight in stock but i just wanted it so badly so i was like do you know what? i'll just size up but looking back i should probably size down and this is the second white top on so even though this one is a size 10 and it is a little bit big for me i think because it does have all the elastic detailing obviously going on it actually doesn't look as bad as what you would think it would i would definitely prefer to obviously stay true to size with this one but as I said, I don't think this is going to stop me from wearing it. I do still think that this top is so, so cute and you can literally wear it with anything. As I said, it's like a more casual version of the last white top that I showed you guys. Princess Polly actually have so many pairs of jeans and I was like, clear, you only need to get one pair. So I really had to restrict myself and basically not pick up like 10 pairs. And these are the jeans. So then they're, they're kind of mum jeans. They're kind of straight jeans. They're kind of like in the middle. I won't say they're overly mum jeans but they're not overly straight jeans they sit there in the middle you guys will see obviously from the try on clip how they do fit me normally a light wash of jean wouldn't be my chosen jean wash but i'm so happy that i got these and they're stretchy like i'm gonna try and show you guys just how stretchy they are like they stretch <sighs> honestly i can't wear jeans unless they are stretchy so when these arrived and they were stretchy i was like oh my goodness i am the happiest girl ever so yeah pick these up i got these in a size 10 as well normally on the bottom half i am like nine times out of ten a ten <laughs> and then i normally have to belt it around my waist but i would say with these i probably could have gone for a size eight obviously it depends how you want your jeans to fit in a way i'm kind of happy that they are a 10 because then they're really comfortable and i don't care about wearing them because they're comfortable and then to go with the jeans i decided to pick up a new belt so i haven't had a nice belt in literally ever 
in the past 20 years of my life, I don't think I've ever owned like a really, really nice belt. And I really, really wanted one. And guess who decided to provide that for me? Princess Polly. So this is the belt that I got. I'm going to do it up so you guys can kind of get a little bit of a vibe of what it looks like. So this is just what the belt looks like. Obviously, it's just plain black with gold hardware. And I am just obsessed with this belt. I really just like how much of a statement it is, but it's not too much like in your face. And also, fun fact, this is the only belt that I have ever bought that I haven't had to pierce holes in. Like, it goes really, really small. Obviously, I normally wear belts around my waist. And... I have a small waist, I'm not going to lie. So a belt that can go really, really small, like that is how small it will go. You don't find a lot of belts that will go that small. So these are the jeans on as well as the belt. I just thought I'd give you guys a little bit of a close-up of the belt first. You can't really tell as well that the jeans are too big around my waist because the belt literally does the perfect job of, you know, keeping everything all together. But if I just stand back, then this is what the jeans look like on. As you guys can see, they are literally, you know, I could probably do the splits in these. And I have just rolled them up at the bottom just to kind of add a little bit of a shape to them. They are so comfortable. All the pockets as well, they're all real, which is great <laughs> because that doesn't normally happen in women's jeans. So yeah, I'm really, really happy with these. I love the wash. I love the fit. I love the style, literally everything about them. And as well, obsessed with the belt, if you guys can already tell. So the next piece I'm going to show you guys is actually a dress. And I know that we've just started to come into autumn and Princess Polly have some stunning summer pieces. But I do also think that you can style these things so they do fit in to autumn. So this dress, again, I'm obsessed with. I'm going to say that with everything I know. But this is the first dress. Obviously, it's very hard to show you guys while sitting down. So when I do the try on clip, it will be so much easier. This is super, super different for me. I wouldn't normally go for something like this. But I thought this with a little bit of a leather jacket over the top, which you guys will see in a second. I thought that would be so, so cute. I will just say the top of this dress, the section up here, is sheer. So you may want to wear something underneath if that doesn't float your boat. But the bottom of it does have lining underneath. So it does have a white little slip skirt. So obviously you're not flashing anyone. And then across like the hip area, it's all elasticated again. So I did get this in an eight, but I would probably size up in this one. It definitely does fit and you guys will see, but just for I think the length of it, I would have definitely sized up. But again, it's really not the end of the world. It still fits and I can still tell that throughout autumn, I'm going to wear this so much. I've literally been saving it so I didn't wear it before this haul. But now that I've showed you guys, I can happily wear it and plaster it all over my Instagram. <laughs> so I just said that I had a leather jacket for you guys and I picked up one from Princess Polly. I have been looking for my perfect leather jacket for probably like three years now. I have one and I'm just not in love with it anymore. But this one... I'm here for it, let's just put it that way. I picked this one up in a 10 just because I wanted it to be a little bit oversized so that way in like the autumn and winter, I can shove a jumper underneath it if I want to. But also I think an oversized leather jacket is really nice over a dress. This is the one that I picked up. They had a few leather jackets. So if you guys aren't a fan of this one, they do have more choices. It has a few zips, it has a few pockets. I feel like pockets in jackets are literally so essential to, you know, keep your hands in when it's cold. I'm really happy with how this looks and I feel like leather jackets are one of those things that only get better over time. Like they never get worse, they get better. So I'm so excited to wear this to absolute death <laughs> in a good way because then it will look really good. So this is the white floral dress. I've literally had to like cut my face out of the shot just so you guys could see obviously the whole dress in all its glory. But I am obsessed with it. You guys can see it from the back. I just think that this dress is so, so super cute. I have decided to put on a white long sleeve top underneath just so then that way it's just all, you know, covered and all one block colour. But as I said, if you guys don't mind you know having a little bit of sheerness then that is obviously absolutely fine and you guys just do whatever you guys want to do but i did think that we could obviously pair it with the leather jacket so if i just whack this jacket on as you guys can see it just kind of you know edges it up a little bit and just makes it a little bit more autumnal obviously you could just drape it over your shoulders as well or wear it i think personally for me i prefer it draped over my shoulders but i know that a lot of people can't really get on with this kind of vibe and it just like falls off or they just find it irritating or pointless but i personally think as for like the fashion side of it i definitely prefer the leather jacket draped over but it's such a lovely leather jacket as well this is just basically what the whole outfit looks like together i was so excited for the dress and i'm definitely not disappointed with it we have another dress and this is what it looks like it's gonna be really hard to show you guys on camera just because it is obviously 
black and spotty but basically it's just like a kind of like a tea dress i think tea dresses are so so cute it does have a little drawstring around the waist so you can do it up as tight as you want it and it does have quite a deep v but there's nothing stopping you from safety pinning it which is probably what i would do just because i'm not exactly you know the most boobalicious gal out there i like it that you can kind of alter it to however you want this dress reminds me of all the wrap dresses that were really in fashion last year but instead of being a wrap dress like all the way over it just has two little frills coming down either side of the front of the skirt i would pair this again with the leather jacket or maybe just maybe like a cream jumper and that could be like your autumnal oh why not cream jumper and leather jacket and a pair of boots I think that's the look that we would be going for but I got this again in a size 8 and then this is what the black polka dot dress looks like on you guys can't really oh there you go you guys can see the length of it it is honestly the perfect perfect length I am obsessed with it as I said I think I would just pop a little bit of a safety pin just in here or maybe tack it with a needle and thread just so then it's just kind of like secured because it does obviously go down lower and something could pop out but overall i am obsessed with this dress again i just think it's such like a lovely yet staple piece fits absolutely perfectly i love that you can do up the drawstring to have a you know big or small that you want it a lot of dresses these days don't actually have the drawstring at work and it just kind of there's like a little minor detail next up we have a play suit and i am such a sucker for cute play suits and this was actually the first thing that i saw on the whole princess polly website and was like wow that's a bit of me and I need that in my life. So this is the play suit and I really, really love this because if I ever go out, I'm not really that fussed about my legs being cold, but if my upper body is cold, that is when we have an issue. So I really love that this play suit obviously has long sleeves because then I won't be getting cold. And also I feel like with all of these pieces, they're very versatile. You can wear them in summer, spring, autumn, winter. So it is in this lovely khaki green colour. I think khaki green is such a lovely colour. And again, it has a little drawstring waist that actually works. So you can obviously tie it up to however tight you want it. And then the shorts at the bottom are just like a layered really material kind of thing. Again, you'll be able to see a lot better on the try on clips. And again, if it's too deep for you, just safety pin it. I would rather it be too deep and then for me to be able to fix it rather than it be like up here and you're like, what do I do now? I'm sorry, but is this or is this not just the cutest play suit you have ever seen in your life? I am obsessed with this. Like, she's cute. So this is what it looks like from the back and then obviously the front. I love this so much i feel like you guys can probably tell i've already started planning my holidays for next year and i can guarantee you guys that this is coming literally everywhere with me because this is such a perfect holiday play suit it's a really really lovely material it's kind of like the cheese cloth material if you guys can tell and it has a little elastic -y sleeve so it kind of makes them like a bell sleeve but this is such a perfect evening outfit whilst you're out on holiday and the material is nice enough that it's not too thin so you're not going to get really really cold but it's not too thick so you're going to be really hot you know you can just literally Go out of your hotel room, go grab some food, go grab some drinks and have like the best time ever. And the final thing in this haul is actually another dress, but I was kind of um and ah and about it. I wasn't so sure if I was going to like it, but the model looked cute and I was like, Do you know what? If she looks cute, then maybe I can make it look cute. But when it turned up, I was like actually blown away. I think it's so simple. Do you know what? I'm just going to show you guys. So this is the dress and it doesn't really look like much on the hanger. It's basically like a vintage mocha colour kind of flowy dress. But I think that this is something that you just need to whack on and you look like you're good to go. So it just has a little tight detail around the waist. Obviously if you didn't want this then you can just pair it with your own belt. And it just is plain at the top but the sleeves have little frill. Well I say little. That's a pretty big frill at the end. They are three quarter length. And then the skirt section of the dress, again, is just all layered and frilly. And then the back of the dress just has a big keyhole detail. So 
I am obsessed with this dress. You guys will see it when it's on. And this is the final dress, which I am, I'm so obsessed with it. As I said, it's so, so different for me. And I wouldn't normally pick up something like this. But I feel like that is literally the point of trying out brands that you've never tried before. The point is to go out of your comfort zone and experiment. And then you'll find things that you love. I love all the layering. I love the material. I love the little tie up. I love the sleeves. Literally everything about it, I am just obsessed with. And I could really imagine this dress with just, a tan pair of sandals on holiday or maybe a gold pair and just having the best time ever can you guys tell that i really really want a holiday <laughs> so that is the end of this try and haul and i hope that you all did enjoy it don't forget about the giveaway that i have going on with princess polly over on my instagram make sure you guys go and enter that because as you guys can probably tell their pieces are incredible but if you can't wait for the giveaway winner to be announced then go and check out princess polly now i will leave as i said all the links down below in the description along with my discount code which is love to leah 20 if you guys want to get your hands on some of these goodies as always if you did enjoy this video don't forget to leave it a massive thumbs up comment down below what you thought and if you have any other video ideas that you guys want to see then make sure you let me know and obviously if you guys aren't already subscribed to my channel make sure you do go follow my instagram enter the giveaway and good luck and i'll see you all very soon with a new one bye